<sighs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Haddle Fox here. Welcome back to the world of Vi. After a little bit of that grind session that I showed you in the last video, I think I'm a little bit more comfortable going up against the boss. As you can see, everybody is in the 20s now. Pottle had just reached level 20. Okay, let's give it a shot. Does my eyes fail me? That's the orb. How can I just float there? Oh, I see. It's sitting on a jet of air. If you want the orb, fight my minion. Yes. Rise, thou elemental! Rise, thou winds! Oh no, a wind elemental! Great. Just great. Okay. strategy down. Just kind of keep them on a certain level. Let's be fine! Sweet! Remarkable! Hey! Yeah. Yeah, I think it's kind of cool. Oh boy. Well, looks like Pottle ain't gonna get jacked. Oh! Rachel's dead! Rachel's dead! Rachel's dead! Rachel's dead! Forget, let the AI do the work now. Wait, why are you using strange brews? You have MP! PJ, just heal him! Oh, that's a revive spell? <laughs> See how much I know! <laughs> Wait, did that- Did he just heal himself? Did that son of a gun just heal himself? Oh, PJ's using items because she's out of MP. Okay. PJ's using that because she's out of MP. But she only got like 14, that's not enough for like other stuff, I don't know. 
Nope. She did have enough. Okay. She only had enough for that one deal. Yeah, I think everybody has the basic uh, level 1 heal spell, which is bomb. But I think they ran out of heal items. So, yeah. Yeah, if Rachel's using bomb, that means she knows, okay, keep your butt alive. Stop. Okay, so I probably have to go back to town to just stock up on some items. Yeah, this is pretty much a battle of keep my freeze. What the heck? would do because the solid form of water is ice. How can wind freeze you? I don't know. I mean, wind can make a vacuum and thus there'd be no air for you to breathe. So, it would be like a vortex of... Yeah, vortex of death, because it would be drawing up all the air, so you have nothing to breathe. Chris, yeah, you're protected, but you're also running out of air. If you're caught in like a vortex of wind. Ugh. Unbelievable. Just what level are you supposed to be at when you fight this thing? Because if I'm supposed to be like mid-twenties to thirty, then that is ridiculous! Because you're going to be spending hours upon hours grinding and I, I do got to level twenty! What in the world is going on? Oh, this makes no sense. No sense whatsoever. Sound like I'm gonna get new levels on my trip down.
And I don't want to use the item. I really don't want to use the item. I, I want to save that escape item. Because you have a spell to revive yourself, but I don't know if there's an item. Spell? Yes. Item? I don't know. I think I'm going the wrong way. Oh. Those cost a lot of MP, and I have no way of replenishing that. There we go. Not even one step, and I'm enter a battle. When, uh, the music is in time with the hit. Either da 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 swing, da 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 hit. So it's just on that. Yeah, I'm off beat. Okay, it's back. it got back on beat. But yeah, you see what I mean when it's a da 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 that last note. It's just nice when they do an action or the, the hit connects. I just like when it, when it does it on that beat, that mark. It's nice. Yeah, you see what I mean. Heal, 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 heal. Heal my bird! Sorry about all the garlic. I don't know what you're talking about. Phew. Whew. Sorry about that. It's on the end. Okay. But Extract. I think the strange bruise heal you for more. I think. Uh, do I have a guidebook for this? Um, one moment. Well, I can design it. Uh.
Okay. I did accumulate a lot of money. If this doesn't do me, I'm gonna scream because I just blew a buttload of money. You guys are gonna cause me the drink! Stupid monster. And let it be known for the record, I don't drink alcohol. I drink tea. Even though I'm technically old enough to drink, I choose not to. Maybe I should stay out here until I can one-shot things out here, then move on to the inside. And once I'm able to one-shot everything in there, I probably would have enough to do the boss. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Let's just go. Yeah, sometimes my friends forget how old I am. I mean, you look at me and people just go, you don't seem that age. And I'm like, yeah. I am that age. And I can show you by pulling up my driver's license. I guess I should take it as a, com as a compliment. I look younger than I actually am. <laughs> oh, these cockatrices are going to be the death of me because they're stoning me. Well, that's what cockatrices do. They do, uh, petrification. So, yeah, I'm kind of getting F there. Ugh. It did it again! The audio just stopped. That's creepy. Oh my god. Well, I think that's because the uh, little cutscene that happens there, you have to cast a spell that gets you up to that staircase. So, I think when the audio cuts there, it's just paying respect to that cutscene where you have to cast the spell to go up. I don't know. Pulling stuff out of my butt at this point. Probably still under level for all this baloney. I know that guidebook is somewhere in this room. I just don't know where it is. And then if I misplace it somewhere, I'm gonna be really sad because my boyfriend got that for me. I mean, I found the Lunar 2 one. But I know the Vi one is around here somewhere. And these are the original guidebooks for the Sega CD. And these are extremely hard to come by nowadays. Oh yeah, that's right. I did find out that um, Vi did get a re-release, but it's for 
like the Android smartphones. The graphics have been updated, the names have been tweaked a bit from the looks of it, but yeah, that's the only other re-release this game has ever gotten. I'm not even sure if you can actually call the Android one version a remake. But so far that's the only other re-release of this game. Which is kind of sad. Well, the company that brought over here working designs closed doors many years ago. And it was a good company. Oh, speaking of companies that have closed doors, uh, Lionhead, that is the creator of the Fable games, has closed its doors. I forget what the reasoning behind it was. I think Microsoft uh, decided, hey, we're closing the doors to Lionhead Studios. I knew that uh, the latest game they've been working on, uh, Fable Legends, had gotten cancelled. But I didn't know at the time it was also closing doors for the studio. I just knew Fable Legends was getting cancelled. Granted, I guess the Fable series hasn't been doing all too well since, I want to say, 3. Because I guess there were some things in 3 a lot of the fans were disappointed with. Then the game that came out after that was Fable on the Connect, And that kind of tanked. Yeah. As soon as I found out, oh, there's going to be a new Fable game. Yeah, it's going to be, you, you have to have the Connect in order to play it. It's a Connect game? What, 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 what's the whole point of a Fable game with Connect? Oh, you um have these magical gauntlets and you you use magic. That's it. Yeah, you you go through the whole game casting magic, and the different movements are the different spells you cast. Not sure if it's canon with the whole story thing, but it may or may not be. Then they were making um. They made like a chippy version. I forget what that's called, but that's um, download on the Microsoft Store. Then they were making, like I said, Fable Legends, and that was uh, going to be a co-op thing. It didn't look interesting, and that's probably maybe why they canceled it. Not enough interest in the game from the fans. And since they've been doing probably bad, they decided to shut the doors. So, I guess that may be the reason. But a lot of people who played the RPG of the previous Fable games and liked them were kind of sad to see it go, because it was a pretty decent RPG. The series was pretty good. I mean, you... You could customize your own character. The choices you made actually affected the game. If you were good, uh, you, pretty much people respected and loved you. If you chose the path of villainy and all that stuff, people would outright fear you. It, it was a pretty interesting mechanic. I think people just lost interest after when 3 came out because, well, the whole good and evil level up thing was, the whole level up system was kind of weird. In order to get certain weapons, you had to uh, do a certain task. 
because the the first weapon that you get is uh, customizable depending on um, certain actions you take with that blade. Like if you slayed a, cer a certain amount of undead, it would take on certain characteristics. If you were wealthy, ha had a lot of money, it would take on certain characteristics. And mm. it was interesting that it was a that the that the weapons would morph depending on certain things. But I I guess the people just didn't really like the story of how Fable Three was. Not to mention, Elder Scrolls did a whole lot better with their story and character and all that. Oh my god, I can just gush on for hours about Skyrim. Oh. I am so glad a co-worker of mine talked me into getting that game. He's like, yeah, you, sh you should try out Skyrim when it comes out. And I, I finally grabbed it probably a couple of months after its first release. And I'm like, oh my god, what have I been missing out of with this series? Then I remember I've seen the third game before. But with the whole level up system with Skyrim, it was just beautiful. Because normally with the Elder Scrolls, it was like, okay, to increase your stamina, you gotta run around, jump around, blah blah blah. Nah, I didn't have to do that stuff in Skyrim. I want to level up my lock, uh, my lock picking. I go pick a bunch of locks. I want to level up my archery. I'll go shoot some stuff with my bow and arrow. If I want to be a sneaky son of a gun, I'll just sneak around a lot. Do I work on my, uh, blacksmithing? Do some blacksmithing. Feels really good. Well, I guess this is sort of turning out to be another grind session, which kind of stinks. Oh, Rachel's about to go up a level. Yeah, that's what happened last time. Rachel went up before PJ. So, they're sort of catching up in levels now. Yeah, I think she's about to go up. Yeah, she's gonna go up soon. Okay, maybe I'll do a bit of grinding off the screen and try once again. I don't know. That just seems like what I have to do with these Sega CD games right now. I have to do some grind sessions in order to progress. And it, it, it kind of stinks that's what you gotta do in these old school RPGs, but that's how it was back in the day, guys. We have to grind for like hours. And it's not like how it is in Pokemon now where everybody gets an EXP share. No, you have to grind for hours and hours and hours switching who is in front. Rachel went up a level. Yeah, you kids got it easy nowadays with your grind sessions. Alright guys, take it easy.